Uh, this is Janet, two years now, has had abdominal pain. Countless doctor visits, have, they have not been able to find out what's wrong. CAT scans, x-rays, no idea what's going on. And she said, today she's been healed. She has no more pain. And how long did you deal with that? It's gonna go a little bit over two years, you know. Over two years you've been dealing with that thing. So walk us through this. You go to the doctor and you're asking them to help you figure out what is wrong in your body. And what did they tell you? He didn't, he just said that, um, when they did CAT scans, like they couldn't find anything, but like I would get like infections, uh, bad bacteria, and um, how bad was the pain? It's unbearable. Like it takes me to the hospital all the time, and then it leads to chest pain. It's just something that I can't explain. So tell us about your experience with the Lord as you were worshiping. Um, well, I just knew the presence of the Lord was going to be here, and I told myself before I got here that I'm going to come with great expectation. And, you know, the word of God says, do not be afraid, just believe. So I was like, you know what? I just got to make a choice and I'm going to choose to believe. And, you know, I know that God healed me and I told God, you know what? I'm just resting on your finished work, you know, of the cross. very personal some of the things that go on that's all right you can give the Lord a hand it's very personal but we get inside our own minds sometimes we get inside our own minds dig I have Dursi here a year ago was diagnosed with arthritis in her back pain all the time even when she came in she said as she was sitting in service pain pain throughout the whole service and she said as she was worshiping she said she felt the Holy Spirit come upon her and she was trembling and she said she feels no more pain in her back anymore. And how long again were you dealing with that pain? About a year ago. I, I was told that I was diagnosed with uh, beginning of arthritis and um, the pain is severe and the doctor said this is just minor, but the pain felt so severe to me. And a week, over a week ago, God told me in a dream to ask and I shall receive. And I asked and I felt this heat coming over me. And when I was sitting here, I started feeling this heaviness over me and the pain started coming to my back. And when I started worshiping and praying, I just started feeling the Holy Spirit through my whole body and I, the pain just left. Thank you, Jesus. So show us what you could not do before that you can do now. Look at that smile. That's how you know it's the real deal. If, I, if we had the service just for that smile, it would be worth it. So no pain doing that. Pain. What would that have been like for you before? Uh, it would have been a 10, and I never complained about pain. Not even labor was nothing for me. But this pain was severe. It was like a 10. No pain would take, the, no medicine would take the pain away. And tonight, God has taken the pain away himself. I have Barbara here. Three weeks ago, uh, she fractured her wrist. Doctor said it would take months to get uh, back to normal. She even had a brace on earlier because she couldn't move her wrist properly. She couldn't close her hand. I can see the imprint from where the, the brace was. Close my, I couldn't close my fingers. I could move them now. I couldn't even move my wrist. I couldn't even move my wrist. I'm a math teacher. I need my hand. Say it again. I'm a math teacher. I need my hand. And you couldn't open and close. Show them again, open, close. Yeah, I, I can open and close, and I couldn't move it either. I couldn't even write my name. You couldn't even write your name. I had to use my left hand to do the work. Now you can go teaching in Jesus' name. Made whole. Can we give Jesus a hand of praise? Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.